<laughs> so good! Oh my god. <laughs> That's what we're looking for. Cat. Okay, are you ready for him to throw it that fast? No. <laughs> <laughs> Cut! So we're filming with the new Canon XC10. So we are doing this video in collaboration with Canon for their brand new camera and we shot the entire video on that camera and we wanted to capture every sport that we could think of. We've never done anything like this before so we did our Zorb soccer video, it was a big kit. So we're like, let's try and cover every sport in one video. So hopefully you guys like it. Dakota, what would Josh normally be doing? Okay, so I'll have you go out. Dakota, tell him when he should stop. So Dakota, part of Team Super Tramp, used to be a really phenomenal baseball player, still is. So I'm having him make sure we are staying true to the baseball rules. That's the thing with making movies, is you want to stay as authentic as possible, or you guys always call us out. Here I am with the Dykes family. And we got our superstars right here. <laughs> so the Dykes family, they're based here in Utah and they're actually a vlogging channel. So tell us a little bit about your guys' channel. We vlog every single day. We have a lot of fun hanging out with people like you. This is an awesome family to check out on YouTube. I'll have a box pop up right here. Be down below in the description. Okay, what's going on you two? This is how we have to deflate the Zor balls. And how do we fill these up this time? Because we are we don't have power here, so what happened? We had to go knock on three doors to ask people if they had power outlets. And the first two people thought we were salesmen, and so they didn't answer their door. But the third guy, he was nice enough, and he let us use his outlet to use a pump to fill up the ball. You guys are okay getting the beating? Yeah. Oh, I can get beat. Okay. okay. <laughs> Here we have two of our main athletes. Was it scary for you at all? Because you couldn't see a whole lot, right? Oh yeah, yeah. I was afraid I was gonna so just like flop over. <laughs> yeah. You can't do you anything. Can't. And super thanks to Vasa Gym for hooking us up to actually be able to stop here. We only film each location for like 20 minutes at that. Then we go to the next one. Whoa. Hey guys, I'm miserable. Whoa. I have really bad allergies. I can hardly see out of my eyes. Like, I can't see the camera right now. <laughs> and it's like my biggest weakness filming, so don't get allergies because it's like it just sucks. And I'm just trying to be positive. I want to see that you're technical with it, that you can get it up and then land and then roll. I'm so excited. I always see Devin's videos and I'm like, that looks so much fun, or I want to do that. And so now I get to be part of one and I'm like, woo woo. Tiffany is a phenomenal, phenomenal musician, singer. Is that the right way? To yeah, say it? wow, thank you. So check out her YouTube channel right here in this general area. But her stuff's phenomenal. She did a lot of covers and a lot of original songs as well. So check her stuff out and you won't be disappointed. He's so. emotional because he's listening to my music. I was. It just, all you know, over really here. gets you sometimes. I don't know if a jump looks stupid or not. I don't usually jump. How was it doing parkour in a Zorb ball? It was extremely difficult. I'm really so, tired. It wasn't easier. <laughs> a phenomenal parkour athletes, Parkour Utah. Check them out. I'll have a link below in the description. And super thanks to these guys. These guys went above and beyond what we could have asked. We had no idea what they could do with the actual ball, but they pulled it off. Here we are with Creighton and Paul with four paddles. Four paddles. So they're hooking us up with the board. You see the paddle board and the actual boom. That's why they call it torch paddle, baby. We got a pretty fast moving river here. And I've never actually paddle boarded inside a Zorb ball before. So we'll see what happens. We have
have Sean here from Utah Bubble Balls, and they were the ones that hooked us up with these awesome bubble balls slash zorbs or whatever you want to call them. So Sean, tell us a little bit about your guys' service. As you can see from Devin's awesome video, you can do just about anything with bubble balls. Really, they're always fun for something as simple as soccer, and we do all sorts of events like that, whether it's birthday parties, family reunions, or corporate events. So feel free to check us out, rent us out. We actually shot the Zorb soccer video with these guys, so they're just awesome, easy to work with. We'll have a link below in the description. That's a wrap, guys. I survived with the worst allergies I've ever had filming. 14 locations. We filmed the 14 locations. Like, who does that in one day? Like, within, it, we started at 8 a.m. as far as filming. We ended at 12, what time is it, 12, 10? AM once again. Uh, we did this video with Canon, which we've always wanted to work with Canon, so super stoked to Canon. Thank you for trusting us. So I had the opportunity to use the Canon XC10 that shoots in 4K, so I was super skeptical at first, but let me just tell you a couple, this is like coming straight from me as a filmmaker. I'm not saying this because I'm paid or anything like that. I'm, I'm not paid to say any of what I'm gonna tell you guys right now. These are the reasons why this camera is a good camera. Um, there's always disadvantages, there's tools for different things. Um, this camera in particular, it has a screen that can flip and there's definitely other cameras that can do that kind of stuff. But it also has 4K for an affordable price. It's really good with low lighting and it's just an all around good camera. And it works very similar to Canon DSLR cameras. So if you're familiar, familiar with the 5D, 7D. And also the big thing too is it already comes with a lens that can go from 24 millimeters to 240 millimeters. So that's another big deal. And it's just a great camera starting off or if you want to do something on a, on a professional level or semi-professional for that matter. So first time using a camera this small. Um, so it was definitely a change of pace, but it was really cool because we didn't have to change the batteries like we normally have to do every 30 minutes. This video was inspired by the YouTube hit video, How Animals Eat Their Food. I think it has over 110 million views. But it's kind of this wacky sense of humor as far as funny random things. So we're like, let's take that kind of idea but kind of take it to the next level as far as with action sports stuff. So let's show all action sports in a ball because it's something interesting and something different and we could connect with all these different people and different sport enthusiasts. So we want people to watch like, okay, what's the next sport gonna be? So we made everything super short and that's why we had 14 different locations. So as we always say, thanks so much for watching. Thanks to Canon and everyone else and over and out.